God bless you, brothers and sisters. Today, again, is an exciting day with an exciting topic that we're going to speak about and pray. And I pray that you who are joining in now or later will be blessed by this message and also these prayers in the name of Jesus. So we're going to start with just a word of prayer. We're just going to invite the presence of God in our midst. We're just going to ask the Lord to take control of this prayer session. We're going to ask the Lord to put words in my mouth. And we're going to ask the Lord to connect the right people to this session in the name of Jesus. So Lord, we come to you at this hour and we just want to thank you for your mercy, for your grace, for your compassion that never fails. Lord, you alone and you are God. Father, we glorify your name because you're faithful. We glorify your name because you're wonderful and you're excellent. God, you have proven every single day that, God, you are an unfailing God. Lord, you are omnipotent, omnipresent, omniscient. We give you all the glory in the name of Jesus. Lord, as I'm about to pray with your children today, I pray, Almighty God, that you take absolute control. I invite you, Holy Spirit, to come and take full control over this prayer session. Holy Spirit, minister to me, minister through me, so that it will touch the heart of your children. In the name of Jesus, Lord, we give you glory. We give you all the honor. We so I soak my life, my destiny, my family, my ministry, everything that concerns me in the blood of Jesus. Blood of Jesus, laminate my life right now. Blood of Jesus, I saturate myself into you right now. In the authority, in the name of Jesus. Lord, take absolute control. In Jesus' name, amen. So today we're going to look at a topic called Prayers to Expose Unfriendly Friends. Yes, the topic is Prayers to Expose Unfriendly Friends. So before we pray today, I just want to give you a little bit of scriptures and give you a little description of on what, on what is an unfriendly friend or who is an unfriendly friend. And then we get right into prayers. So let us look into some scriptures. So let's turn to our Bible, to Zechariah 13, um, verse 6. I'm going to use the King James Version for this one. Zechariah 13, verse 6. King James Version. And one shall say unto him, What are these wounds in thine hands? Then he shall answer, Those with which I was wounded in the house of my friends. Then we're going to look again at Proverbs 26, 27, I mean, Proverbs 27, verse 6. I'm going to use the King James Version again for this one. Proverbs 27, verse 6. If you have your Bible, just turn to Proverbs 27, verse 6. So I'm using King James Version. So faithful are the wounds of a friend, but the kisses of an enemy are deceitful. Then we're going to look at Micah chapter 7, 5 to 7. Again, I'm going to use the New King James Version. Do not trust in a friend. Do not put your confidence in a companion. Guard the doors of your mouth from her who lies in her bosom. For son dishonors father. Daughter rises against her mother. Daughter-in-law against her mother-in-law. A man's enemy are the men of his own household. Therefore, I will look to the Lord. I will wait for the Lord, for the God of my salvation. My God will hear me. Then we're going to turn again to Proverbs 18, verse 24. This time I'll use the New International Version. If you have your Bible, it doesn't matter the version, just turn to it. New International Versions, Proverbs 18, 24. One who has unreliable friends soon comes to ruin. But there is a friend who stick closer than a brother. And that's Jesus, obviously. And our last scripture that we're going to look at in this section is Psalms 55, 12 to 14. So Psalms 55, 12 to 14 says, If an enemy were insulting me, I could endure it. If a foe were rising against me, I could hide. But it is you, a man like myself, my companion, my close friend, with whom I once enjoyed sweet fellowship at the house of God as we walk about among the worshipers. 
So there's just some scriptures that I share with you and I urge you to go and read them over, meditate on them, and the Lord will continue to bless you as you do so. And as we continue, I just want to explain to you who is an unfriendly friend, or you might ask, what is an unfriendly friend? So an unfriendly friend is someone that is in your life as a friend and is an enemy in disguise. So if you ever hear the term, an angel of light, an angel of darkness appearing as an angel of light, I'm sure you probably hear that term over and over again. So an angel of darkness appearing as an angel of light. That's an unfriendly friend. So an unfriendly friend is someone that is around you as a friend who is a backstabber, who is envious, who is a betrayer, who is covetous, who is a backbiter, who is disloyal, who is a traitor, who is a deceiver, who is a liar, who is a gossiper. They gossip to or about you, your family, and anything that is connected to you, that's an unfriendly friend. A friend, an unfriendly friend is a friend that is a clear description of Judas. And if you all know Judas in the Bible, what he did to Jesus, that's an unfriendly friend. They will sell you out in a heartbeat for anything. They will sell you off for 30 pieces of silver and they can sell you for a plate of food. That's an unfriendly friend. An unfriendly friend is a friend who is, you know, a friend that will derail you from your God given purpose knowingly for reason of jealousy, envy, or, or simply that they do not want you to outshine them. You have friends that are like that. They don't even want you to lift your head, you know? So those are unfriendly friends. An unfriendly friend is one that speaks doubts and defeat in your life. So anybody that's around you, that is your friend and they're speaking so many doubt and defeat and they make it so eloquent to the point that you start to believe them watch it that's an unfriendly friend an unfriendly friend is one that makes you question who is your god where is your god and they steer you away from god to follow the devil anybody that tell you to stay away from christ and follow the devil run that's an unfriendly friend an unfriendly friend is one who identifies you behind your back by your weaknesses or your limitation. They never accept your strength. They see your strength as a source of annoyance. That's who an unfriendly friend is. Your strength, you know, if you're good at singing, good at reading, good at preaching, good at your career, good at anything, they see it as annoyance. They, they don't see it as a, you know, a, as a light in you. They don't see it as one of your strength. They don't see it as something that can uplift even themselves or others. More it becomes... It becomes more like a, like a source of annoyance um, to them. An unfriendly friend is one who joins with your enemies to conspire and to gang up against you. An unfriendly friend may satanically gang up against you. They may gather in evil associations against you. That's who an unfriendly friend is. An unfriendly friends are servants of the devil. They will eat your flesh and they will drink your blood with every opportunity they get. That's who an unfriendly friend is. An unfriendly friend is, you know, an enemy. They are real enemies of your life. And they must, they will watch out for, you know, pretty much an opportunity for you to mess up. So these unfriendly friends you need to watch out for and you need to pray against them. An unfriendly friend is a friend that may pretend to have your back, but never wish you well. Really and truly, they're there, they're like your support system, your network, but really behind your back, they wish you possibly could even die. They will, they will laugh with you and they will rejoice with you, you know, in front of you, but behind you, they want your demise. An unfriendly friend is one that is close to you when you are in problems and then they stay with you pretty much. To know all your pain be and, and behind you, they multiply your battles. So they'll go and they will start their little embezzlement to send more arrows and more attacks in your life. And then, you know, these type of friends, you know what they do? They will laugh at you. Some of them will even do a thanksgiving behind your back for your downfall, your problems and your struggles. They don't know sometimes that when you go through your problems and your downfall and your struggles, God is taking you to another level. So that's who you see. That's a clear description of an unfriendly friend. 
Unfriendly friends, you know, pretty much they have been around and in the lives of many for centuries. You know, if you see from scriptures, the Bible speaks of them. You know, the Bible didn't say they're unfriendly friends, but really that's who that's who the Bible talking about, unfriendly friends. They can be likened to the devil. You know, only the devil pretend to be given some something good, but in reality has only one intention to kill, to steal and to destroy. And that's exactly who an unfriendly friend is. The total replication of the devil. So we need to seriously pray today. We need to pray to expose those secret enemies in our lives pretending to be our friends. Before we get into the prayers, if you have not given your life to Jesus Christ, I'm giving you the opportunity now to accept Jesus Christ as your personal Lord and Savior. You want to be able to do that so that your prayers when you pray, they are effective. You know, when you give your life to Christ and you start to pray, I believe personally and from a Christian standpoint that your prayers are more effective. So I just want to give you who are listening to me the opportunity to give your life to, to the Lord Jesus Christ as your personal Lord and Savior. So I just want to say this prayer and I want you to say it after me. Lord Jesus, I am a sinner. I come to you today. Have mercy upon me. Take, com take complete control of me. Today, I submit to you and renounce sin and the devil. Fill me with the Holy Spirit with the evidence of speaking in tongues. I accept you now as my personal Lord and Savior. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. I just want to congratulate you for giving your life to Christ. I just want to encourage you to find a Bible-believing church in your era and just let a pastor, a minister, even the usher, let them know that you have just given your life to the Lord Jesus Christ and um, you need some help and some guidance and they will help you to walk through, you know, in your, in your Christian walk and to support you and to mentor you and to, you know, teach you godly principles. Before we pray, let us sing this song, uh, you know, just a song of worship that just come to my mind and um, the Holy Spirit has impressed it upon my heart and we're going to sing it together. If you don't know it, I'll teach you. We'll sing it and we're going to get into prayers. Open my eyes, O Lord. Hallelujah. Open my eyes, O Lord. Hallelujah. Open my eyes, O Lord. I am ready to obey. Sing with me now. Open my eyes, O oh Lord. Hallelujah. Open my eyes, O oh Lord. Hallelujah. Open my eyes, O oh Lord, I am ready to obey. Thank you, Jesus. Before we pray, we're going to go to the Lord and ask the Lord for mercy. Pray to the Lord for mercy. Let us pray. So, Father, we come to you and we cry out to you at this hour for mercy. Lord, let your mercy prevail over our lives. Lord, I pray that you have mercy upon your children, Lord. Lord, as they join on this prayer line, Lord God, as they join on this prayer outreach, God, I pray, God, that you open their eyes, Lord. Lord, have mercy upon them, O oh God. Have mercy, O oh Lord, in the name of Jesus. Father, Lord, I pray in the name of Jesus, Lord. That you will purge their lives, God, and cleanse them from every sin and iniquity, O oh God, that they have brought in their life, O oh God, because of their associations with unfriendly friends in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, we cry out to you for mercy, O oh God. Lord, we ask you for mercy, O oh God. Have mercy upon us, O oh God, according to your riches in glory, O oh God. Blot out our sins, Lord Jesus, Lord. Have mercy, O oh God, in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we thank you, Lord, for your mercy. In Jesus' name, amen. O oh Lord, purge my life 
and cleanse me of every sin and iniquity I have committed by my association with these unfriendly friends. In the mighty name of Jesus, O oh Lord, my Father, purge the lives of your children of every sin and iniquity that they have committed because of their associations with unfriendly friends. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. O oh Lord, rekindle the love of your children, O oh God, that they may trust and rely solely on you. In the mighty name of Jesus, Father, rekindle our heart, O oh God, so that we have love, God, and trust, Lord, to rely solely on you. In the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Divine wisdom that cannot be deceived. Come upon our lives now. In the name of Jesus, divine wisdom that cannot be deceived. Come upon our lives right now. In Jesus' name we pray. Now we're going to ask the Lord to open our eyes and open our ears. Father, open our eyes, O Lord. In the name of Jesus, my Father, open our eyes. In the name of Jesus, O Lord, open our ears. In the authority, in the name of Jesus, Father, by your great mercy, open our ears. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Anything in my, in my life attracting unfriendly friends to me, be uprooted in the name of Jesus. Personalize the prayers. Anything in my life attracting unfriendly friends to be uprooted in Jesus' name we pray. Every mockery of the enemy pretending to love me die in the name of jesus every mockery of the enemy pretending to love me die in jesus name we pray oh lord by the blood of jesus detach my destiny totally from unfriendly friends right now in the name of jesus every harm done against me using my picture and other personal effects receive divine solution now in the mighty name of jesus i take authority take authority now my brothers and sisters i take authority over all curses pronounced against my life by unfriendly friends and i command them to break by the power in the blood of jesus in the name of jesus Oh Lord, by your supreme power and authority, let every sensitive information I have shared about my family with unfriendly friends be taken out of their memory right now by fire in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, let them totally forget anything that they have, I have told them, oh God, that they can use against me and my family. In the mighty name of Jesus. Every virtue that I have lost as a, a result of my relationship with unfriendly friends, I recover them back by the blood of Jesus Christ. Every yoke of unfriendly friends upon the life of your children, oh Lord, let them break by fire in the name of Jesus. I fire back every arrow fired into my life by unfriendly friends in the name of Jesus. Blood of Jesus, Holy Ghost fire, acts of God, separate my life and destiny from unfriendly friends in their authority in the name of Jesus. Wherever an unfriendly friend has taken my name for evil, I command the Holy Ghost fire. To answer them for me right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Wherever my name is being called for evil, Holy Ghost fire, disgrace them in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, fill me up with your fresh fire that my life may become inaccessible to unfriendly friends and their evil plans in the mighty name of Jesus. Blood of Jesus, 
separate me from all unprofitable friends in the name of Jesus. Blood of Jesus, separate me from all unfriendly friends in the mighty name of Jesus. O oh Lord, by your mighty hand, fight for me against all unfriendly friends who are angry with your blessings in my life in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Every power that must die for my breakthrough to manifest, die in the mighty name of Jesus. Every unfriendly friends walking about to do me evil, I command you to die in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. O oh, mountain that boasted against me, your time is up. Scatter in the mighty name of Jesus. You mountain that bolted against me, your time is up. Scatter by thunder in the name of Jesus. Every tongue of unfriendly friends speaking against my destiny, I condemn you in the mighty name of Jesus. Every evil friend preventing me from moving forward, fall down and die in the mighty name of Jesus. My problems face the anger of the finger of God in the name of Jesus Christ. Every evil load transferred into my life by unfriendly friends, I return you back to your sender in the name of Jesus. Holy Ghost fire, chase away every unfriendly friends in my life in the name of Jesus. Every power that has dug a pit for me, fall into your own pit in the name of Jesus. Every arrow of unfriendly friends, backfire right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Evil priests assigned to carry out satanic assignments against my life on evil altars by unfriendly friends. I command you both, the priests and the unfriendly friends, to die by fire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Evil legs, walking about for my sake, I cut you off with the sword of the Lord in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ, my deliverer, knock out every darkness in my life in the name of Jesus Christ. I recover everything that unprofitable friends have stolen from me by the power in the blood of Jesus Christ. I command every hand of unfriendly friends stretch out against my destiny to wither now by fire in the mighty name of Jesus. You evil hand that is stretched out against my destiny, that is stretched out against my life, that is stretched out against my marriage, that is stretched out against my career by unfriendly friends. I command you to wither now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. By the blood of Jesus, I destroy every satanic soul tie I have with unfriendly friends in the mighty name of Jesus. You unfriendly friends in my life, make mistakes that will expose and disgrace you in the name of Jesus. I command every unfriendly friends in my life to make mistakes that will expose and disgrace you in the mighty name of Jesus. You unfriendly friends pretending to be the solution to my problems, I command you to make mistakes that will expose you to everyone around me in the mighty name of Jesus. Unfriendly friends that is rising against me in judgment, I condemn you now in the mighty name of Jesus. Every power assigned to kill my joy, what are you waiting for? Die in the mighty name of Jesus. Witchcraft activities carried out against my life by unfriendly friends. I command you to catch fire right now in the mighty name of Jesus. My father, deliver me from the trap of unfriendly friends in the mighty name of Jesus. 
every power assigned to kill my joy. What are you waiting for? Die in the mighty name of Jesus. Let every problem that has been transferred into my life, let every problem that has been transferred into my career, let every problem that has been transferred into my family, let every problem that has been transferred into my health, let every problem that has been transferred into my marriage, let every problem that has been transferred in my ministry, let every problems that has been transferred in my finances through demonic friends, loose it all now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You can put whatever you believe you want to pray about. It could be your children, it could be anything, just put it into the slot and pray about it. Let every problem that has been transferred into my life, but through demonic friends, loose your hold in, in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, arise and expose anything hidden that is against me in the name of Jesus. Every evil pit that has been dug for me by unfriendly friends, I command those who have dug it to fall into the pit themselves in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, arise and expose any hidden enemy against my life in the name of Jesus. Every door that I have opened to unfriendly friends that have brought evil into my life, oh Lord, shut it by your mercy in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Every spell of death cast upon me and my family by unfriendly friends. I command it to expire right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You spirit of arrow projected against my life by unfriendly friends. I command you to get out now by fire in the mighty name of Jesus. Every satanic arrow fired against my marriage by unfriendly friends. I command you to go back and destroy your sender in the mighty name of Jesus. Every satanic deposit that has entered my body through the hand of an unfriendly friend, I command you to come out of my body by fire right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, expose anyone that is mindful in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, expose anyone that is my foe in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Holy Spirit, wipe off from the memory of unfriendly friends every information I have shared with them that they are now using against me in the mighty name of Jesus. Every harm that unfriendly friends have done against my destiny through the use of my pictures, and my, my, and my personal belongings. I undo you now in the mighty name of Jesus. Every home that the unfriendly friends I, have done against my destiny, have done against my family, have done against my life and my ministry through the, my pictures or anything that belongs to me. I undo you, I undo you now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I release my prosperity from the hands of unfriendly friends in the name of Jesus. Every valuable item that have been stolen from me and kept on evil altars by unfriendly friends, I command those items to be disconnected permanently from my destiny in the name of Jesus. Every satanic enchantment made against my life by unfriendly friends, I command you to expire right now in the mighty name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus Christ, I decree that I shall no longer go to my enemies for help. In the mighty name of Jesus. I want you to say this prayer. This is serious. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I decree that I shall no longer go to my enemies for help. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I decree over your life that you shall no longer go to your enemies for help. Oh, mighty God. Every effort of unfriendly friends against my business, I command it to fail 
right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Every effort of unfriendly friends against my career, I command it to fail. Right now in the mighty name of Jesus, every effort of unfriendly friends against my marriage, I command it to fail. Right now in the name of Jesus, every effort of unfriendly friends against my life, I command it to fail. In the name of Jesus, every effort of unfriendly friends against my family, I command it to fail in the authority in the name of Jesus. Every effort of unfriendly friends against my finances, I command it to fail in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Every problem I am now facing as a result of my association with unfriendly friends, oh Lord, deliver me from them in the mighty name of Jesus. Every association I have joined, consciously or unconsciously, through the influence of any unfriendly friends. I disconnect myself from them by the blood of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, open my spiritual eyes in the name of Jesus. Father, open the spiritual eyes of your children in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, separate me by the blood of Jesus. From unfriendly friends that are around me in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Oh Lord, give me, oh God, grace to always discern when unfriendly friends come around me in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, give your children the grace to discern when unfriendly friends come around them in the mighty name of Jesus. I command all the evil plans of unfriendly friends against your marriage to fail now in the mighty name of Jesus. Every evil plans of the unfriendly friends against my marriage, against your marriage, I command it to fail right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, by your mighty hand, destroy every demonic attachment of unfriendly friends from my life right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I break myself free from every demonic influence of unfriendly friends in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Oh Lord, connect me to the right persons in the name of Jesus. Father, connect your children to the right people in the name of Jesus. I decree over your children, oh God, that they will be connected to the right friends, to the right people in the name of Jesus. I scatter every unfriendly friends that is around your children in the name of Jesus. Father Lord, we thank you, Jesus. Mighty God, I thank you for delivering your children from the grip of unfriendly friends in the authority in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Father, Lord, we thank you, O God. Lord God, for exposing every unfriendly friends in the lives of your children, in the authority in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, amen. So, Lord, we just want to thank you for... These prayers that we have prayed, you know, Lord, to teach our children how to pray against and to expose the unfriendly friends in the name of Jesus. Through the blood of Jesus, we thank you for your delivering power. We thank you for your redeeming power. We thank you for the resurrection power, Lord Jesus. And we pray that every unfriendly friends around us, Lord, will be exposed and be disgraced in the mighty name of Jesus. Their plans over your life will not stand, it will not succeed, it will not prosper in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, your word said in Psalms 41 verse 9, Yea, mine own familiar friends, in whom I trusted, which did eat off my bread, had lifted up his heel against me. And Lord, you said in your word in Psalms 118 verse 8, It is better to trust in the Lord than to put confidence in man. Lord, I pray over your children that they will put their confidence in you and not in man. In the name of Jesus, I pray that you will please in God and not man.
Lord, I also thank you for your word in Matthew chapter 26, verse 23. It says, And he answered and said, He that dippeth his hand with me in the dish, the same shall betray me. Lord, I just want to soak these prayers in the blood of Jesus. I soak my life in the blood of Jesus. I soak myself in the blood of Jesus. I soak this ministry in the blood of Jesus. I soak my family. I soak my husband in the blood of Jesus. I soak everything that concerns me in the blood of Jesus. I soak my home. I soak my car. I soak everything that I own in the blood of Jesus. I soak every one of you that is listening and praying with me in the blood of Jesus. I soak your families in the blood of Jesus. Any power that want to attack us because of these prayers that we have prayed, Holy Ghost fire, destroy them. Any power, any wicked human being that wants to attack me because of these prayers that I'm praying, my Father, arise in your anger and disgrace them in the name of Jesus. I fire back every arrow that the enemy has fired against me as a result of this prayer in the name of Jesus. My God, we thank you. Father, we bless your name because you are faithful and you are mighty and you are victorious God. We give you all the glory. We give you all the honor. We give you all the praise. Accept, ex, accept all of our prayers right now in Jesus' name. My friends, I pray in the name of Jesus that you have been blessed by these prayers. I pray that the Lord will expose every unfriendly friends from your life, from your family, your marriage, your career, all that concerns you. I pray that the Lord will separate unfriendly friends and bring good godly friends around you. I'm happy to share the word of God and prayers with you on a weekly basis. If you need any prayers or you need, you know, you have a prayer request, feel free to send us an email. Um, you can go to our website, Oh God Arise Ministry, and just fill out the form, send us a prayer request, and we'll be praying for you and praying with you. God bless you and may his face shine upon you and um, may he be gracious unto you in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, my friends, I will be um, sharing most likely on a Wednesday or Thursday with you prayers and um, whatever the Lord leads, I'll just do. And if you have any topic that you would want me to pray about, just send it on in an email and I'll do the research through the scriptures and come up with the prayers and we can pray together. We can move mountain with our prayers and um, we trust that the Lord will hear us and answer us. God bless you. and. Um, have a wonderful week in Jesus' name. Amen.